Rafiq sir, allow me to share the screen. Rafiq sir. Ah, okay, okay. Good evening all. My screen is visible to all. Yes, sir. Ah, okay. Thank you. Uh, today, first we start with Zotero reference management software. Reference management software is very essential to prepare academic manuscript. It saves time and uh, it helps us to neatly organize references. 
many reference management softwares available we are familiar with the endnot mendeley zotero zotero is a free software um, open source in nature mendeley is a proprietary one both features and functions are same anyway uh, it's an open source one i recommend this one first to, to start with zotero first we have to create an account zotero.org is the home page is the home page click on login button here we can see an option register for a free account register for a free account first we have to enter username to do not forget we can apply we can enter here the username of our gmail account if it's available it says that the username is available then your email id and the password this is a username second is an email id third is a password then click on register button the user get an email confirmation check the inbox click on the link your account will be become ready this way we can create zotero account we open the zotero home page click on login button and click on register for a free account enter username email id password and click on register button okay check the inbox you will get confirmation email click on the link confirm the account generation then uh, to login click on the login hyperlink enter username and password click on to login to zotero first we login we enter into web interface of zotero where we can see suppose i have already uh, i have already an account we can see here uh, the references i have saved earlier the next thing is we have to go to home page and we have to download and install two software component sir can you just repeat the same sir oh sure 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 yeah um okay we are going to create an account of sotero sotero.org is a home page uh to create an account click on login button see here register for a free account link register for a free account here we have to enter username Uh, don't forget the username to avoid to forget the username later you can enter there the username of your gmail account then enter your pass uh, email id two times enter your password and click on register button a, a verification mail sent it to your inbox open inbox click on the verification link and confirm the account creation okay this is the process of account creation next is we login into zotero account enter username enter password click on login to zotero okay after that we have to download zotero software client software and web connector home page we can see a download button red download button 
from home page find here a red download button uh, see here two download boxes in blue color one is zotero client software client software using that we organize our references it also help to uh, insert index citation and references in our pc it works with windows linux and mac os down click on download for windows users it download the exe file after download finish double click and install like any other windows software i am using linux for linux users um you can download the source code and compile it any linux users here okay i think no linux users here so this will work on mac also right pardon i am using mac this will work on mac also right ma ah, yeah mac mac on version is here edition is here click on ah, mac okay, okay i got yeah. it okay second option is a web connector web connector help us to collect save references from websites it works along with the browser it works with both uh, chrome browser firefox browser and some other browser see i am open this website on chrome browser see here chrome but i can it's an extension install chrome connector is an extension after the installation of after the installation of the client software click on install chrome connector suppose you are using maybe using firefox browser you can uh, install this extension on firefox okay it works with both firefox and chrome both are two popular browser okay i am going to click on install chrome connector Uh, Sotero can integrate with the Google Doc. No other reference management software can integrate with the Google Doc. So I recommend Sotero. So we can easily manage references in Google Doc. Um, actually, Google Doc works. Uh, click on install chrome connector it will go to chrome web store see here add it to chrome button add it to chrome button click on add extension okay the chrome extension sotero connector extension added to the browser see here uh, click on this button drawer button and pin zotero connector otherwise it does not appear on chrome toolbar okay after the successful installation click on the drawer button then click on the pin button here see zotero connector click on pin button after that zotero icon appear on the toolbar if you hover it mouse hover on it you can see here save it to zotero okay the installation of client software installation of web connector we have to finish before works with before start with zotero reference management software okay uh, see z zotero icon is here that's the installation part it's over install both zotero client software and zotero uh, browser connector after the installation of client software we can see it it appear an icon zotero icon appear on the desktop and it also appear on the application launcher this is the 
uh, icon appeared on my application launcher. Windows users, it appear on the desktop. I am going to open it. This is the interface of Sotero client software. We created an account already. We have to enter account details into this Sotero client software. Click on edit menu, then click on preferences. Where we can enter account details of Sotero. Okay, click on edit menu, click on preferences. Here we can see a tab called sync. Click on sync. This is a sync tab. Here we have to enter the username of Zotero and password here. The purpose of adding account details here is that Zotero provides a cloud storage to save your references. The saved references uh, one instance available in the PC and one copy store in the cloud storage. Suppose your system crash, you can, after fixing the error and format the operating system, we can download the saved references from the cloud storage. So we have to enter account details into Zotero uh, client software. Click on setup syncing. It also sync, store full text content, PDF content, and um, it also store the metadata. Okay, account added. This is the sync button. Press the sync button. It will download the saved references from the cloud storage. Okay, this is the uh, interface here. First, we learn how to organize these references. There is a mechanism here, folders. Using folders, we can organize references into various collections. For example, uh, you can create folders for save various categories of references. For example, you are start to write a book you can create a folder for save your references for the book. Suppose you are start to write the thesis. You can create a folder or collection for to save the review of literature. Okay, suppose imagine that uh, I am going to write a paper on global warming. Uh, I, I, I am going to create a folder to save my references to write that uh, for the preparation of that manuscript. Okay, click on this folder button. Enter the name of the folder, Global Warming. Okay, click the folder created. Uh, this is a broad area, Global Warming. I am also discuss the causes of Global Warming and the effects of Global Warming. I have to create two subfolders inside this global warming folder. Okay, to create subfolders inside this global warming folder, right click, click on new sub collection, right click, click on new sub collection, global warming courses, type the name global warming. Courses. Click OK. A subfolder created. Again, I am going to create another subfolder. New subcollection. Global warming. Effects. Global warming is the ma broad major collect collection. This is the two subcollections. This way we can create 
collection and subcollection to organize your references next is we are going to save or collect <coughs> references into sotero uh, if we are going to save references from uh, so we can uh, collect references from journal databases websites uh, magazine websites then suppose we have pdf files already we have we can import those pdf files into sotero maybe um, on the midst of your uh, phd you learned about uh, these reference management software you have already collected pdf files in in a folder you can import those pdf files into zotero okay first we will see how to import or add already saved pdf files resides in your pc into uh, this zotero for example uh, here a folder some journal articles with me i want to add it into sotero see i am going to add it into this subfolder global warming courses see here a green button uh, click on new item click on this button uh, here we can find an option store copy of file Uh, st store local copy of your pdf files into zotero okay i am going to add pdf files from your pc into zotero the stop zotero 1 2 3 you can multi select it will uh, extract or harvest metadata from web standard journals pdf with you articles pdf with you don't worry about no need to add the details of the journal manually or details of the book manually you can it, it will collect metadata from web see here three pdf files imported its metadata Uh, on the right side this is the full text this way we can add the existing pdf files into sotero this is the one method next is we are going to collect some, some references from uh, some databases like uh, so some academic search engines like uh, google scholar we are going to visit google scholar to collect some references and add to zotero wait a moment ആണ്ട് ഓക്കെ വി ആർ ഗോയിങ് ടു കളക്ട് റെഫറൻസസ് ഫ്രോം ഗൂഗിൾ സ്കോളർ ഗ്ലോബൽ വാമിംഗ് fx india these are the search result 
uh, first of all we have to make sure that this zotero client sh should be open if it's not open the save will not work open it and minimize it and refresh and this is a search result and found that few articles required for our study we are going to add it into zotero click on this web collector zotero connector okay click on it first it show this window click on got it see the icon changed into a folder shape it means uh, this page contain too many references so it turned into the shape of a folder okay it contains many search result articles multiple uh, numerous references available in the same page okay we we found, found that few, uh, we have some articles are very important to us click on this folder button it will list out the articles here it will list out the article uh, on the search result you can select it okay select it and click on okay see see here folders and sub folders i am going to save these references into global warming effects okay uh, see here full text metadata going to save it see also here a snapshot snapshot means uh, it also save the offline version of the website offline version of the website for example um you you are going to save a website the offline version also save later you can open it no internet connection needed an offline version save in the sotero that is snapshot okay uh, select the subfolder click on done and see here uh, see here references saved into in the, in the sotero and visible here this way we can save references from uh, different kinds of scholarly resources like journal websites uh, for example scopus science direct jstor um, academic search engines like uh, google scholar microsoft academic we can save references into sotero then next is how to save an ordinary web page into zotero for example um we we have to save a news from a media website for example global warming india bbc see here climate change uh, this is from a bbc website this is very important for your work okay this is an media web page ordinary website click on uh, see the zotero icon turned into a newspaper shape it detects that uh, this is a media site click on uh, this icon it open choose the subfolder click on done button this web page saved into zotero the offline version also saved into sortiro see here see this is the uh, web page saved from uh, bbc website item type newspaper article this is the title but one thing missed here uh, here author name missed actually author name is mentioned here uh, see here shruti menon while save the reference uh, so zero missed to save the other name in such cases we have to enter enter the other name manually
okay um place is missing suppose it mentioned the place for example delhi you can mention delhi for index citation uh, author name is very important and year of publication is also very important if as per aps apa style inside the bracket we mention the surname comma the year of publication into uh, index citation Uh, next method is we can save it from an identifier for example pubmed pubmed uh, identifier means we can add uh, books identifier is isbn number if we add isbn number it extract book details from the web uh, journal articles unique identifier is doi digital object identifier see here this is the uh, see see the details of a article this is the unique identifier of an article doi same like aadhar number to indian citizens same like this is an identifier unique identifier for an article with online presence just to copy it then uh, click on this uh, wand magic wand icon and enter here extract article details into dotero we can add here uh, arc save id that's the id uh, uh, with the arc save article then DOI ISBN number uh, PubMed ID it it accepts okay then uh, another method is suppose uh, you have collected a local uh, information source like uh, an old book a book published locally but uh, such materials information not available on web in such cases we have to enter the details manually uh, to enter the details manually see here uh, this green button click on this drop down arrow see here various uh, information i various categories of information sources suppose it's a magazine article maybe a book chapter encyclopedic article maybe an email communication maybe a group discussion link uh, maybe a blog post a letter oh, for example here uh, we are going to add manually add the details of a magazine article see here magazine article click on the magazine article it will open uh, the right side uh, menu open there a right panel open there we can enter the details manually then publication name then volume number then issue number then date of publication pages okay this that's enough if it's an online article you can enter url this way we can add the details manually uh, next thing is how to manage references in regional language there is a solution uh, we can add references in regional language using google input tools uh, google input tools does not works with this client software we have to add references through the web interface uh, from the sotero home page see here web library after login we can see here web library uh, 
web interface of our saved references we can see here see here the uh, our collection and sub collection we have created it is synced into cloud storage okay i want to add a regional language references into uh, this collection click on the plus button there uh, see here more magazine article uh, that entry panel will appear type place cursor there title then switch on regional language input tool option then type okay then switch off it enter uh, you can type manually enter the whole uh, article details This method is very convenient for research scholars and uh, writers in regional language. They can manage regional language in, I mean, uh, reference a regional language. Uh, so it will also help us to sort these references in regional language in a proper order. Okay. And this is the methods, various methods to add information sources into various references into Zotero. First is uh, add local locally stored PDF into Zotero. Second is uh, collect references from academic search engines, websites, uh, journal, uh, uh, journal websites. Third is using references using identifier. Fourth is adding details manually. Sir, can you share the video this lecture, sir? Because yeah, after the class, is... after the pro, uh, workshop, you uh, yes, they will share it. Yes, 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 sir. Sir, uh, um, after adding all the references, how can we uh, correlate? Like uh, yes, yes, sir. I will, I will tell it. Okay, okay. the uh, collecting references uh, is over. Next, we are going how to insert it into the manuscript. First, uh, we have to decide which kind of uh, reference style we have to adopt. Uh, that is in edit system preferences. Uh, here, site. See here, some popular reference styles listed here. Um, social science community using APA style, American Psychological Association, language and literature people using modern language association style, and reputed journals and publications has their own style, I nature, one poor style used by um, medical sciences community. Okay, these are the popular styles. Suppose you are using a different style for your work, so Tiro maintains a big repository of style. We can add from here. Click, click on this plus button. Uh, not plus button. Uh, get additional styles. If you want to add more additional styles. Search here. For example, uh, you want to use IEEE style. Institution of uh, Electrical and Engineers. They have a ma many journals and their own styles. For example, IEEE, computer graphics and applications. 
you will add it to the existing list of tiles then close it okay next is uh, our manuscript draft is ready we are going to insert these references into uh, the manuscript i am using it works well with the ms office libre office and google doc see i am using libre office that is in dot odt format this is the manuscript i am going to open it Uh, after the installation of sotero client software it search for which uh, word processor available with the pc and it integrate with the sotero it bridge uh, it uh, add the plugins into the soft, uh, processor sorry word processor in libreoffice you can see uh, sotero toolbar is here in ms office there is a new menu will appear here sotero click on that zotero menu buttons will list down in libre office uh, see here the toolbar this is the manuscript uh, i show that where where is wherever i have to and uh, in, insert the in text citation while writing we can give uh, some indicators like uh, or the name after preparing the manuscript we can add here uh, the original citation i mean in text citation using zotero okay uh, place the cursor there click on this button add edit citation add edit citation uh, doing this we have to make sure that uh, this client software should be open if we close it does not work a search box will come if you know the author name otherwise know the title it will highlight the list of uh, articles if you not sure the author name i mean see the entire list click on here and see here classic view okay either you can search and find the article and add to the manuscript otherwise uh, click on this down arrow click on classic view see here uh, our folder and sub folder choose the citation then click on okay uh, before that <laughs> we have to select our style See here is a gearbox, gearbox button. Click on it. Choose the style. I am choosing. I I I am going to select here APA style seventh edition. Then, ah, refresh it. APA style follows author date system or surname of the author, comma then year. next index citation i am going to place here see here click on this button classic view select it okay again here place cursor here Okay, this way we can add citations one by one, and finally, 
uh, references we have to generate uh, list of references at the end place cursor uh, below the references heading place cursor there uh, choose the option add or edit bibliography okay click on add or edit bibliography see bibliography uh, as per apa style listed here you can add uh, index citation any time after generating bibliography okay it uh, it will automatically refresh it add the uh, newly added citations into the reference list uh, then we can suppo suppose you have submitted this manuscript for publication in a journal unfortunately your manuscript rejected you made some further improvements and uh, going to submit another journal another publication and they says that they want they want style in, in different ma ma different style for example now we arrange the things in apa style uh, the other publishing house says that they want to arrange references in mls style you can easily switch from one style to another click on here choose mls style modern language search in ninth edition click okay it switch from apa to mls style okay it is it change from apa to M we can switch from one style to another without much uh, difficulties this, this is a method uh, method to insert in text citation and uh, create bibliography list at the end of the manuscript and one more thing we have to learn uh, in dissertations books we have add the reading list or bibliography at the end as an appendix okay that's not a reference list that's a reading list or bibliography as an appendix at the end of the thesis or book that's easily we can create using so zero separate a reading list if you want to create uh, first collect references in a folder or subfolder if you want to create a bibliography select all right click arrange all references in a folder we are going to create a bibliography bibliography and reference a separate uh, references have a index citation at the end reference list bibliography is a big reading list only no index citation usually attach at the end of the book or thesis uh, add all these references into a single folder uh, select all control a right click then uh, right click choose the option create bibliography from items create bibliography from items it will uh, shows that which style we have to prepare the bibliography we select here apa style american psychological association 7th edition click okay it save as a separate file the so rtf file we can open using uh, any word processor okay see here this is the bibliography we have created see going to open using libreoffice writer this is the bibliography see this is the bibliography very time saving we can easily generate bibliography uh, we can 
apply in his die. Sir, uh, suppose uh, my reference is not available in the internet, how can I uh, manually I can add no, to Zotero? Yeah, see here, here is option to add the details manually. This green button, click it. Suppose it's a book, click on book. Enter here, item type book, enter here title, or the other details here, and uh, save okay. it. Not, not save, it will automatically save it. Okay, sir, okay. Uh, it, we can attach, we can work, uh, we can connect Sotero to Google Doc. After the installation of this uh, Sotero connector, uh, a Sotero menu appear on Google uh, Doc. And also see here a Sotero icon. The same like we add, uh, we add uh, in text citation word processor, it also works with Google Doc. I'll show here. For example, I have to Place an, I have to place an index citation here. Place cursor here. Uh, click on the menu, Zotero, and edit citation. First, we have to uh, point out a point out a Google account to integrate. Every time we have to do it. I mean, um, when we start the PC and uh, add references in a, uh, fresh references we have to first point out a google account and then only it integrate with the uh, google doc a search box will come click on classic view and choose the uh, reference see it added at the end, uh, same like Zotero, add or edit bibliography, it will generate the list of bibliography. Then you can also refresh it. Suppose you have add a new reference after two days, you can refer uh, refresh it and newly added reference also appear on the reference list. It works with both Google Doc cloud-based processor and uh, offline web processor like uh, LibreOffice and MS Office. Mendeley have no such facility. And Endnote has no such facility. Then uh, backup, if we connect add account into Zotero references, your references will save into cloud storage. No need to take separate backup. Um, they, they provide, they give us 300 MB cloud storage. That is enough for personal use. Suppose you want to uh, get a, get a, create get a manual backup into PC. I mean, into pen drive. It's possible. Advanced again. Edit preferences advanced then files and folders this is a location where we can find zotero backup uh, zotero folder click on show data directory see files are stored in the folder called storage here each folder we can find metadata and a PDF file. See. 
these are the two important one folder is storage uh, inside we can find pdf files organized this is the database one storage folder and this database store into a pen drive as a backup uh, suppose your system crash or you are moving from one system to another after the installation of zotero just place this storage into into their the new pc you will get uh, the backed up data into the newly installed sotero but we have cloud don't worry about it uh, 300 mb is enough and suppose you have very huge number of references uh, it, uh, the cloud provide only uh, 300 mb other um, uh, solutions to accommodate high number of references for example if you want to add references into um, into cloud storage for example dropbox dropbox give you 2 gb storage create a dropbox account um, install the client client software dropbox folder will appear on your pc you can store anything here the same thing it also store in the uh, cloud we can point out this place into dropbox everything regarding or related with the zotero uh, store into dropbox folder one copy available in the pc and one copy in the cloud storage we get 2 gb free storage okay this way we can uh, manage references while uh, preparing books and uh, articles uh, next is uh, how to manage or receive payments payments uh, payments for your book suppose you have printed out your book uh, from your local offset press you are sure that it's uh, you can sold out completely 500 copies you have sold out you can um, you can sell it through amazon or flipkart but we have to give them some service charge but without the help of amazon and flipkart uh, about 80 rupees we have to pay them without amazon and flipkart we can manage online selling of books and accept payments through uh, payment gateways like uh, reserpay i will i am going to sh show you reserpay we can create reserpay uh, payment pages where we can display book details and uh, provision for accept payments through credit card debit card upi and give the link of that page in uh, share the links to social media wherever uh, online other websites display on the websites uh, users can visit it uh, see the details of the book and uh, make payment and give order this is the reserve pay paytm has also has a facility a uh, facility for create payment pages i will show you one uh, payment pages for selling books uh, these gateways uh, they charge a small amount as their commission for example 1.5 percentage or 2 percentage see here the option payment pages see here is a page a page for selling a book this 
this is the url it's not active make it active okay this is the page see here um, see the book we can add images book cover product description then other details then contact details phone number email id uh, other things we can mention and uh, we can also see here the price we can define the price then collect other details like email id mobile number uh, and provision for payment 350 rupees after making payments we will get the intimation see here after successful payment of 350 rupees uh, the green button it successfully received 350 rupees uh, here payment failed okay we can make sure that payment was successful otherwise it says that payment failed some some people uh, for fun they try to order the book uh, and they will withdraw uh, when payment page will come see here the arrived to 2 minutes sir uh, i didn't have uh, can you just re uh, repeat sir i missed ah, that sure. sorry i have to uh, again repeat the payment gateway yes yes, yes sir ah uh, sure 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 yeah see payment gateway is a service financial service uh, it help us to receive payment for various purpose this is we okay. can make use this service for selling books uh, they have a facility okay. called payment pages they have many services we can make use payment pages service from this payment gateway we can create a page which 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 can showcase for the product details book details and we can also make available there collecting um, see collecting contact details to send deliver the book and also we can see here the payment received from the uh, buyer okay this is payment uh, book details we can display here this side communication details here we can uh, here we can uh, make receive payment facility the user can make payment from upi id debit card credit card internet banking see i i will i will show you how to create a new page okay click on payment pages create payment page okay once again open racer pay uh, we have to create a racer pay account we have to give them pan number and other things to create an account then click on payment pages click on create payment page then uh, a lot of templates here go to your own idea start with a clean slate product sale accepting donation ah this is suitable for us product sale use this template enter page title for example credit card book i have suppose i have uh, printed out 500 copies of my new book i have to sell out independently okay this page will help us okay credit card book this is the name of the page here we have to add a uh, product image this is Another this page. is only for when we uh, printed outside any press ah yes yes right. printed so, physical okay. copies of the book uh, using a local okay. offset press okay okay see it all add an image
सी देन then enter details of the book for example Okay, this is the product details. Uh, we can format various methods. Then uh, email ID, other details we can enter, phone number. Then next here we have to add the information collection field suppose we want to send them the physical book uh, by post or courier we, we need their address price field price field Fixed amount. For example, three fifty rupees. Then input field. single line text your name okay we can add what are the information you required to deliver the product large text area for address address with the pin code then we can enter here whatsapp number phone and the whatsapp number this way we can uh, enter here the information collect from the customer. Next is create and publish page. Uh, important is price. We can arrange these things uh, upper or down area. See here. Okay, create and publish page. This is the URL. We can share the URL in our social media website or anywhere online. Okay, I'm going to open this URL. See, this is the page. Email. 
three fifty rupees. Okay, WhatsApp number. Then click on payment button. Many ways customer can make the payment. The failure will be less. Failure of payment will be less. This way, payment pages works. Uh, same like Paytm has this facility. Many other similar services, are, but Razorpay is very popular. Suppose uh, someone made a payment, uh, but we can refund the amount. Just one click, we can refund the amount. Sir, this is the charges. Uh, charges. Sir, this is side chargeable or uh, free of cost? Uh, they, they have some commission. Uh, me, me, uh, one, uh, I'm not talking about the commissions. Whenever uh, I log in, I, I have uh, paid the charges of annually maintenance and everything. Uh, no charges. Account creation is free. Free, no? Yeah. Oh, but uh, each transaction, they will charge a small 1% or 1.5 percentage commission. Oh. Sir, your face is not uh, uh, the showing in full, full. In full. Pardon? Your, your face. Uh -huh. Okay, okay. Okay. Wait, wait. I will show you also payment pages. Uh, we can after payment we can see here entries here <clears throat> then we uh, suppose some refund is needed uh, some refund is need, needed it's possible we can click on press refund the amount will refund to the customer and I click on each entry we can see here uh, their address and other things using that we can uh, send our book issue see here refund option okay this is a method of working uh, payment gateways uh, after a book is sold out you can make it inactive See here, uh, this book is uh, active. We can make it inactive. See. Deactivate. Then what happens, sir, uh, when we are deactivating? Uh, after that, page will not work. See here, error. Link will not work. Uh, next, we are going to learn how to uh, create a web portal or blog to display, or um, I mean, to pub uh, publish the news of your new book and uh, put your. PDF files, open access book, and you can give the link of the uh, link to self-publishing platforms or payment gateways. See, this is my web page. See, I have organized my books in a single page. I mean, separate page. Click on books. See all my books here, uh, the description. Uh, users can freely download the open access edition of the book in PDF format. See, suppose they want a paperback copy, 
I also give the link. Uh, link to uh, link. Link to poti.com. They can buy it, buy it from there. Two options: paperback and open access copy will be there. See, all my books are displayed in uh, book section. Then, how to create such pages? That's very easy. Mm. I am using WordPress. WordPress.com, WordPress package for building this website. Uh, WordPress, WordPress.com is a uh, commercial service they deliver. They help us to build website and blogs based on WordPress software. First, we have to create an account here. Uh, they have both free account and a premium account. I, I, I am using free account. But one drawback is that they show some advertisements. We can, you can also buy uh, premium packages. It does not show any ads. Uh, Black Friday, I mean in November, Black Friday will come. They have some offer, 50% off they will give for 750 rupees. We can buy a premium version of WordPress.com. Otherwise, free is good. Uh, some little advertisement will show, but here, no advertisement here. Okay, first create an account with WordPress.com, but one problem with uh, free account is that uh, this is the instance of my website. WordPress, sorry, email 0212.wordpress.com. This is ugly. It, it, everybody can know that this is a free version of WordPress. But I mask it. I mask it using this domain. Actually, so someone type vimalkumar.info, it leads to this website. I mask this custom URL. I bought uh, this domain name from godaddy.com, attach this domain into this WordPress URL. So let's check the price of domain name. Godaddy, type your name. And enter your name it will shows the possible or available domain name see here vimalkumar.com 89 rupees small price vimalkumar.in 49 rupees for one year if you uh, buy it for one year two year three year or four years vimalkumar.co.in 39 rupees only co 69 see these are the available domain but Vimalkumar.org, it has a high 749 rupees. Okay. We can. This price for one year, sir? Or uh, uh, Actually, this is for one year. Okay. But uh, purchasing for three years is uh, more good because they will lower the price. Okay. I will log in and show you. But um, better buy for three years. Suppose if you buy for one year, the second year they will enhance the price. We have to mm -hmm. up, uh, re, we have to renew it every year. But uh, the second uh, first time we renew it, they will enhance the price. It's better to buy for three three year. They will give you more offer. Okay, first you create an account with the godaddy.com. See, these are the domains I bought. 
vimalkumar.info uh, after made payment it will become us uh, here is a manage option after creating one instance of wordpress.com you will get the custom url vimal0212.wordpress.com i have to uh, forward that custom url wait domain setting see here domain setting forward domain Uh, here is an option just to give the wordpress url someone type vimalkumar.info it will lead the uh, lead the user into vimal0212.wordpress.com see here forwarding see vimalkumar.info destination this website very simple a professional website is very good uh, we can post our publication details uh, other events okay this, this way we can connect by domain and connect with the wordpress.com <clears throat> then now we can see how to create a, uh, how to manage this portal see this is the dashboard uh, of my wordpress created website vimal0212.wordpress.com this is the home page see here appearance many themes it's available beautiful themes available we can choose a theme and customize it three column four column uh, different kinds of themes available some themes are free and some themes we have to pay see next is two kinds of information we can post one is post one is pages pages has some permanent nature posters are dynamic posters means uh, see here news we can publish as publish it as a post this is a news on a workshop event we can publish it as a post okay these are the various uh, news same like a diary new entries arrive on the first okay then uh, pages are temporary in nature for example your publication you have to list out we have to create it as a page that's the difference between pages and uh, posters posters are dynamic it appear on sir, the home page is this, sir is this similar to uh, google site sir google site yeah similar to google sites but uh, this is a dedicated uh, software for portal making blog blog making okay. uh, but it, uh, it has very rob lot of ro uh, very robust it's a dedicated software for any purpose it has a lot of okay. plugins we can make it for magazine publishing make it for personal website make it for e-commerce sites we can convert it as convert it into many purposes yes yes okay um, then how this uh, how this menu works i will show you see here uh, you click on books 
see uh, i posted these things are a, i i posted these things are blog posts actually uh, this uh, this is a menu category all posters regarding books gathered here or arranged here there is a mechanism here i will show you show anyway first i will show you how to create a post click on posters add new enter a title for the post okay enter here uh, i am going to announce uh, post my new book credit card enter here the matter then we can format it uh, we can justify it uh, either left center or right then next is we can add an image uh, see here justify upload an image click on it make it small Ah, one more thing. Wait, wait. We have to create a three D image of the book. Wait. We can create a three D image of the book for the promotion. Three D book cover. Yes. A uh, lot of three D book cover image service is available. these are the examples of book jacket uh, cover for public public publicity we can display 
for uh, display in your blog web web posters uh, web blog posters and uh, social media we can create a 3d cover site is diybookcover.com click on it upload your in uh, sorry upload Single. Next. Okay, then. Click on next. download it as png format see this way we can create 3d cover 3d images of the book Okay, we added matter uh, and we have to uh, here download open access edition of the book. Open access edition we have to download from here. Now open access edition uh, PDF format mm, uh, we have created. PDF version we created, we have to attach here that um, we have to upload in media library. Wait, wait. See, 
media library is there we can upload images and pdf files into here add a new sorry documents add a new yeah open click on it this is the url done hyperlink it open in a new tab click on apply then next is paperback edition available on pothi.com not arrived here anyway uh, paperback edition you can mention to buy paperback edition We can link it. Okay. The next thing is where it should appear. Uh, yeah, click on save. See here the category book. This post will appear in the appear in the book category. Then we can add tax credit card personal finance and book. That's enough. Sir, if what is the to... use of uh, putting tax? Uh, tax means uh, this is the keyword for search engines. Okay, okay. Actually, Keywords. I am enter here the details in Malayalam. Search engines cannot okay. identify. Suppose someone search for credit card in English. Yes. Uh, it will not display this book page. But I, I give okay. it as a tag it will uh, chance for ch high chance for uh, index in google search engines okay okay then click on publish then one more thing we can connect with uh, twitter a new blog publish it will also pub uh, publish as a po twitter post Uh, one more thing also we have to care. Wait, wait, wait. Uh, one is slug. Slug means <clears throat> URL. Change the actually this is uh, it take url from title this is malayalam title i can change book url into english and update see here click on book see Actually, this belongs to book, this post, 
go to someone click on books uh, the related uh, the this is the related post it appear on the book page click on here till this so this can download it then one more thing uh, it also appear on the home page see then we can also track how much download happened that is from statistics see here stats uh okay file downloads see can find statistics so months here <clears throat> see the um, statistics download statistics in current year 2023 this year 115 This is ninety-two, fifty-four. Then we can see yes, twenty-two. What? How much download happened? See, two thousand downloads happened. Okay. Here we can track uh, and some stat very detailed uh, professional statistics track plugins available. We can enable it. You will get very detailed information regarding uh, how much it downloaded from which region. These things we can track. If you want to withdraw the post. We you can change it to do uh, draft format. Draft format. Okay. Uh, there is a draft option is here. We can uh, withdraw it. Suppose we want to withdraw the post, we can withdraw it. Visibility, uh, yeah, public. Right. Then summary. Okay. Draft. So switch to draft in the below. Where, where, switch to where draft. Uh, uh, where? Yes. No, no, no. Uh, in below, below, below. Below. Other. After other. Uh, 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 switch. Okay, okay. Draft. Switch to draft. Ah. Uh. Yes. Uh, okay. Okay. Uh, anyway, uh, WordPress is very good to maintain blogs and the personal website. We can showcase our book very well. Suppose if you share this book details among so in social media groups, uh, give the link to okay. Like uh, share like this. Copy link address.
in whatsapp group if you want to share share your, your book in pdf format give it this link suppose someone click on the link it also count in the wordpress portal we know how many people download the or uh, download the book give the entire url this way it works anyway uh, to maintain uh, showcase your uh, book and publications create a wordpress blog and one more thing i will also show you how the menu system works menu appearance menus see this is the menu structure books actually books uh and books menu it 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 use the category books suppose a post has book category see here a book category it will display uh it will dis it will display on the automatically categorized under book menu it will come under book menu suppose a tag we can attach a tag for example training book tag every post with the book tag come under come under the menu books very easy to convene very easy to manage elements of a website no need to know uh, programming or html tags and also uh, add your uh, website home page url or domain name into email signature see here see all settings at the bottom see here email signature you can mention your home page uh, domain name other blogs address as a signature email signature your name designation institution profile urls also mentioned here if you when you send an email email to some this digital signature also attach along with the each letter the people will click on the link you will get more hit and they will download your book and read it anyway uh, these things we have to practice Anyway, these these are very easy to manage and organize uh, the price is very low buying a domain by an instance of wordpress sir uh, can you suggest uh, apart from this uh, can you suggest any application for improving uh, type typing or uh, typing improve the typing. normal uh, typing typing, typing Type, of uh, re regional languages no 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 typewriting no, normal uh, to improve the speed and uh, ah, okay okay <laughs> typewriting uh, okay okay writing text is the best method to improve your speed of keyboard uh, keyboard practice is the best method to speed up your typewriting yes yes <laughs> otherwise uh, i learned typewriting typewriting i joined the inst typewriting institution uh, after my slc exams it makes my, it uh, improve my typewriting speed yes yes i think that is practice. the best 
Ah, yes. that's the best method to improve your typing method. speed. One one month is yes. enough. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. But without yes. Uh, without uh, um, look on the keyboard, you can uh, type it very fast. Yes, 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 yes. Now I am uh, doing my PhD, uh, so I need uh, more typing for uh, preparation of uh -huh. my thesis. Uh, suppose you are preparing manuscript, you can make use Google Doc. Um, I will show my. Yes. Uh, actually, my, I prepare my thesis myself. Uh, oh. After everything I prepared, I just give uh, give it for printing and binding. Yes. Uh, I will show it. See, created each document for each chapter. <clears throat> yes, yes. Yeah. Um, I think I, I felt very convenient to prepare uh, thesis in the Google Docs. Okay. Finally, I downloaded in Docs format and uh, uh, give it a DTP sender for a final touch up only. I, everything I uh, in a print ready, I pass the documents to them. Okay, sir. Any, any doubts regarding this? If you have any assistance or further doubts, you can ask in WhatsApp because many things just you watch it, but if you uh, try it, you get more doubts. A uh, lot of yes, uh, definitely, videos, definitely. Ah, uh, yeah. Suppose, for example, when you deal with the uh, work with Amazon Kindle Create, uh, lot of videos in YouTube, and their official video is there. And uh, every uh, publishing aspects in Amazon KDP, they have a very good tutorial and videos. Hmm. We can uh, access it through their website. But any doubts, you can uh, uh, we can you can post it in our WhatsApp group. I can answer it. I yes, think sir. that yeah. you feel uh, now you feel that publishing is very easy. Um, if you if you comfortable with the keyboard and the PC, we can easily manage it. Yes. Sir, I want to ask one one thing. Ah, uh, please. Sir, ah, please, please ask. Uh, sir, whenever we create the uh, website in WordPress, okay, how yeah. to uh, connect with the URL? Uh, we get the subscription of the hosting. Ah, uh ha, -huh. okay, okay. So how yeah. it will be? Get Whatever may be the uh, website portal. I mean, website software you are using, hosting space. Uh, you can buy. You uh, domains from godaddy.com, but uh, wait, you can also buy domain from wordpress.com. Actually, their price is a little bit high, and you can buy there and at attach with your website. Suppose you want to buy domain from other website, many sites available. But Godaddy, uh, I bought it from Godaddy. I feel that it's easy to manage. See here. Uh, See here the domain I bought. See uh, these domains I bought for my friends. Click on manage. Click on settings.
in dns part see here forwarding in forwarding see uh, here is an option add forwarding an entry will come see here click on editing uh, add your wordpress custom url then click on select forward to masking masking means uh, vimalkumar.info is the url if you click on talks see here the url sub url will not visible there that is masking others cannot see your wordpress url it will hide it that is masking then title of website description keywords someone search for librarian or koha software it will appear this way we can attach a url in your uh, purchased uh, domain name uh, actually this is very simple but uh, ordinary people don't know how it works that's the main problem just uh, this price is very nominal you can buy it and uh, practice it any other questions sir thank you for your uh, nice classes sir for a very thank helpful you. Oh, okay okay, okay. Yes, kindly open your camera everyone kindly open your camera and ask anything whatever you want and for the preparation of my thesis it is very very helpful and uh, yes yes uh, in which university uh, you are doing phd no sir i actually am working as assistant professor in central university and now i joined for phd in my department only central kerala university in kerala no no tamil nadu tamil nadu okay which department A music department. Music department. No. Okay. Okay. Your native place Kerala. Kerala, Tripunitra. Tripunitra. Okay. If you want to learn Sotiro in detail, when you arrive Kerala, come with the laptop in our library. We will teach you Sotiro in detail. Yes. Yes. Minutes. Definitely, sir. Definitely. Definitely. <laughs> i watched many videos but i didn't get the idea how to install how to uh, ah, okay. run the so i asked you <laughs> yeah um, we have a, some digital literacy course in our library and two research scholars in music rlv rlv college attended uh, oh, okay okay yeah. my wife was working in rlv college oh i see in dance department okay Yes, I came there, sir. I request. Sir, sir, you are in Kottayam. You are based in Kottayam, right? Yeah, my native place, Changanasheri, Kottayam district. Work okay. with the uh, Mahalma. Yeah, I am. I am based in Delhi only, but now I am in Kerala. Uh, my uh, uh -huh. I am from Kerala, so uh, I am planning to visit Kottayam next week. So, because this is daughter, or no? I am very interested to learn more about that. Okay. So if I can visit you in person. Oh, day. sure, welcome. <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> You'll be in the uni university library only, right? Yeah, uh, yeah. I work with the central library, Mahalma Gandhi University. Okay, okay. Before before I come there, no. Before I come, uh, come because I have some some friends in Kottayam. So before I uh, uh, come to Kottayam, I'll uh, get in touch with you. Oh, sure. Okay, welcome. I work with the World Resource Institute in Delhi. Aha, uh -huh, I see. W R I. Okay. Ah, okay, okay. 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 Thank you, everyone. Uh, if you want to express your view regarding this uh, uh, 
the planning program actually uh, the vimang sir is uh, given the very very informative this is a very informative planning program uh, such a wonderful sir i learned lot of things uh, uh, in this uh, uh, book publishing so i i have no idea how to use the tools and how to the publish the book and how to collect the data what uh, after this training i learned lot of things about uh, uh, publishing and marketing and razor pay and how to create uh, how to create website also this is a very very important matlab this is a very very important matlab you gave us uh, knowledge regarding the entire system of the publishing you know including the marketing and all of so thank you very much uh, sir and rati rati pyar is also very active sir uh, thank you your uh, putting in your questionings and uh, time to times and you, i think you have um, uh, clarify all things uh, regarding this uh, uh, training point and uh, and uh, we we need sir is also uh, is there so uh, thanks of all participants uh, to come this uh, training uh, training program and thus uh, bharat digital academy last but not the least i am request ka bimal kumar sir please uh, say some words regarding uh, this uh, uh, this training uh, this training program and what is your experience yes sir uh, uh a uh, few months back we have planned five days offline workshop of book publishing but we received two three registrations so we have cancelled that workshop but uh, actually my wish was which is that uh, just to cre- create a structure of the workshop so i uh, proposed this workshop anyway um we are going to organize a offline workshop of book publishing for two three days in our university uh but uh, we have to we have to publish uh, books and other kinds of publication then only uh, others will recognize us uh, as and uh, uh, respect us so we get more opportunities and a career growth um, we have to uh, increase our publications either books or what or maybe uh, see uh, in academic uh, community context book publishing is very easy now very a lot of simple tools available uh, earlier uh, we have to depend upon publishing houses to publish it uh, institutions or individual can become a publisher uh, but um, if we start writing that will be a habitual thing we will publish a uh, lot of books anyway i um, wish you a good uh, publishing i mean publishing more publications in near future anyway uh, just inform us when you publish your books uh, put share the links in our our uh, digital publishing i mean uh, in our whatsapp group also okay wish you all the best thank you sir thank you very much but sir your matlab actually your idea is very good sir i am very impressed <laughs> this idea actually the people is uh, people do, people are don't know exactly what is the technique of the publishing what uh, if you are academicians and you are librarian and you are businessman this technique is very very helpful for everyone not only yeah. the teachers but you are uh, you are getting the lot of the knowledge regarding the uh, publishing and and free of cost you are publish your book uh, whenever you go to the publisher sir please please uh, take this uh, text and publish my book but after the this training you can publish your book well uh, you, uh, you told us uh, about the uh, isbn number and everything matlab uh, everything uh, regarding the publishing book, book in uh, this uh, 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 training program so thank you very much to, sir for uh, giving us such a wonderful knowledge and uh, and your plan is very good i am very impressed and i think the all participants are also very impressed on this uh, uh, workshop uh, the next month we will uh, i i also think that that we will uh, conduct the, uh, the offline program uh, to this uh, book publishing planning uh, program
so thank you very much thank you very much everyone for coming this evening i will send you uh, the certificate uh, by your register email by tomorrow and after tomorrow no? don't worry thank you very much sir thank you uh, nish ji you want to say something bi nish i think you are from kerala also no 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 it's okay thank you okay thank you very much sir thank you thank you thank you okay thank you thank you sir thank you sir thank you sir